Hey, it's Pierre. <clears throat> so I'm gonna try and uh, hit with the three Prokenix uh, momentum rackets, these three, and try to discern a little bit between them. I'm gonna hit some rails, volleys, and drops, and just see what I think, uh, and see if I can compare them a little bit, you know, real time right now. So, it kind of plays into what I thought when I, as I've been hitting with these over the days. This kinetic momentum, even though it's got its headlight on the balance, it just feels head heavier and a little heavier when I'm playing with it. And I think it's, it's that kinetic feel. So, it was just a, it's just a little a touch too much for me. My favorite is definitely the the counterbalance one, the orange one. It's um, it feels it doesn't feel head heavy, but it it feels like overall pretty light. But it's got some heft to it, enough heft for me. So that I feel like when I start my swing, I'm going to get something good behind it. And the speed is just lighter. So that's for someone who wants to really whip at the last second. But I always find that. Once I start my swing, I, I want it to kind of follow through for me a little bit. And in this one, you really have to put in that effort at the last. So, so it kind of playing into what I thought. I'm going to hit some volleys now. See how that goes.
So on the volleys, interestingly, the CB was my least favorite. The, um, the speed is really good because it's, it's so light that you can just quickly, um, quickly get on the ball and, uh, and also feel like you can take it in short at the last second. So that's where the speed really excels. C CB was pretty good, but just felt just a little slower through that, through that middle zone. Maybe if I volleyed more, that'd be a problem. <laughs> and uh, the counterbalance was actually, I mean, sorry, the kinetic was actually pretty good there. That extra little bit of head weight forced you to kind of, kind of um, come through it a bit more. And it felt, even though it was tiring, and I've been playing, I've been playing a lot. I actually played with this today. Hell. So CJ's out for the playoffs. Okay. He's uh, away. He's Injured? Oh, up. okay. So it's you, me, and Matt. All right. So Wednesday and then Monday. Wednesday here, yeah? Wednesday here, Monday here. Right. That's what you get when you're the number one seed. <laughs> All right, I'll see you here Wednesday. Um, yeah, so this actually felt pretty good on the volleys. Uh, it was, like I said, just, I could feel, I had to do a little bit of extra work to, have to come through it, but the extra weight made me feel like I was um, able to control a little bit more as I was on the shorter swing. All right, now we'll try a few short balls. So interestingly on that, they all felt pretty good. Of course, the speed being the lightest, you feel like you have the most maneuverability up there. Um, the counterbalance kind of in the middle for me, it was nice in that I could just sort of, just like in the, in the back court, I could set up and just follow through smoothly and the racket would do that work. And then the kinetic, interestingly, Felt pretty good, and this is the one area where I feel like I can feel the difference of the kinetic material in there, is when you're stuck up there and you just use a little bit of wrist, I feel like that maybe, you know, it's hard to tell whether it's just in my head, but it feels like I can sense that kind of extra follow through on a really short swing more easily than I can kind of from the back or the middle on a bigger swing. There, it just feels like normal, but up here, I. I feel like that, that little wristy bit um, is, feels a little different with the kinetic. It means you can kind of come in really short and just flick your wrist to kind of take the shot or flick your wrist to get a lob off uh, a little bit more easily. Uh, so there you go, a little bit more 
a little bit more feedback on those three Procanix momentum brackets. Thanks again to Dan from Procanix for providing those for, uh, uh, for me to review. Appreciate it. Thanks a lot.